Due to taking this passion and language class that's also the university, I'm Hector. Let's talk about when I'm and who I'm jumping in. Rao and Carson is Vietnamese. Similar to the English alphabet, Vietnamese alphabet letter consists of Nguyen Âm, Rao, and Phu Âm, Carson. Here you can see the similar qualities of the Vietnamese alphabet Rao and Carson, and English alphabet Rao and Carson. In total, there are 17 Vietnamese Carson and Rao vowels. Because Vietnamese vowels are more complicated than the consonants, we will start to learn the vowel first, which read it to the drums. These are the trial vowels in Vietnamese. As you can see on the slides, we have three versions of A, two versions of E, one version of I, three versions of O, two versions of U, and one version of Y. Let's learn how to pronounce this vowel. First, three vowels of A, A, and O. Now, look carefully at my mouth. A, A, O, A, A, O. Can you see the differences when I pronounce these three letters? Well, the first R equal the normal R. As you can see in the big picture, this R is thrown out with your mouth open wide in an normal stop and the teeth of turn stay forward, touching the base of potent front teeth and the rod come out from the middle of your mouth. Now, repeat after me. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Well then, let's move to the second R. I call this R with a spine. Now, look carefully at my mouth. Ah, ah, ah. To pronounce this letter, your mouth has to stretch to the side and the tongue makes a big curve. The rod comes out from your throat. And remember to raise the tongue as a little bit. Repeat after me. Ah, ah. Up. The last R, E R, with a hand. Your mouth had to be a little bit rounder, as you can see in this picture. The teeth of the tongue stay forward, touching the base of bottom front teeth. The roll come out from the roof of your mouth, and you also have to raise your tongue a little bit. Repeat after me. U, uh, U, uh, U. Uh. Well, that's here are some sample for you. Listen carefully and repeat after me. Um, 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 ka, ka, ka. Well, that the next word of vowels either to air, the normal air, and air with a head. Look carefully at my mouth when I pronounce these letters. A, 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 A. Can you see the difference? To pronounce the normal M, your mouth had to stretch to the side and from a normal horizontal stylist. The tip of the tongue stay forward, touching the base of bottom front teeth, and the rod come out from your toes. Repeat after me. A, 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 A. Good job. The Ronaldo air with the head. Open your mouth so that the shape of your mouth looks like a shape in the picture. The tip of turn stay forward, touching the base of bottom front teeth, and the right come out from through of your throat. Repeat after me. A. A, A, 
Eh, well, then, here are some examples for you. Listen carefully and read this after me. Then, 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 then. Well, then, the next flowers are E and E. In Vietnamese, these two flowers are thrown out the same. Somebody called them the soft E and the E correct. Plus, many other people just call them E Nam, the short E, and E Yai, the long E. Nam means short, and Yai means long. So just call them the short E and the long E. Every girl is able to understand. It's super easy to pronounce these letters, just E. Repeat after me. E, E. E, E, Good job. Here are some examples to practice. Listen carefully and read this after me. B, B, U, W. Well done. Next, we move to another group of vowels which consists of letters A, O, S, U. Look carefully at my mouth when I run out these letters. A, O, U, A, O, U. Can you see the difference? Here we have the normal A. There are with a head and there are with a hook. There's here a hook on the O letter. It just is right. Well, choose another normal. Uh, let the right come from your throat and open your mouth widely. Your mouth should have the sharp of the circles. Repeat after me. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Well, then. next, the arm with the head. To run out this letter, narrow your mouth and let the right come out from the foot of your mouth. Repeat after me. Oh, 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 good job. The last one, uh, with a hook, open your mouth in the shape of horizontal stylus and let the voice come from your middle of your mouth. Repeat after me. Uh, 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 uh. Well done. Let's practice a little bit. Read it with after me. La, lo, le, ko, kom, ke, an, on, on. Well done. The final group of vowels consists of two letters. U and Ooh, with a hook. Look carefully at my mouth when I run out these letters. O, U, 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 U. For the normal U, your mouth has to be round again. But don't open your mouth wide. Just make it look like a small circle. The sound comes out from the middle of your lip. As in, U, U. The sound of rain. Repeat after me. O, 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 O. Good job. And for you, with a hook, keep your upper and lower teeth nearly close to each other and stretch your mouth to the side. Then make the voice come out from your tongue. So repeat after me. O, O, O. Mm. Well, this. Here are some examples to write this. Listen carefully and repeat after me. Mm. 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 Mm.